Hello, hello. Good night, guys. How are you today? How's everything? It's good. We're good. No kind of. Mm -hmm. All right, guys. So thank you guys for being here once again, class. You know, I appreciate your being here. I know you could have been like sleeping or something like that. You know, you could have been doing something like that. So thank you for being here uh, on the class once again. So just... Uh, da -da -da. Okay, let me see. Okay, cool. All right. Um, so uh, just so you guys know, today is actually the the last day of uh, classes of this week. And then we are going to meet until next week, right? That's basically uh, how it works. That's basically how we are doing it. Okay, just uh, just so you don't know that, okay? Um, before we continue, um, that's exactly what I was going to say. If you guys have questions, uh, I see Catherine has a question. So tell me, Catherine, what's your question? Can I speak in Spanish? No. <laughs> Try in English and then do in Spanish. Okay, today and the, the group and sent me a message and I need to send as well and a new uh, file about uh, an inscription, but I couldn't understand because uh, I don't know what. Um, uh, um, uh, no sé si me puedes repetir eso, porfa. Ahora en, uh, en el transcurso de la tarde me enviaron un mensaje uh -huh. que dice que pero nuevamente que envié el formulario para el módulo, pero no entiendo qué módulo. O sea, porque este no lo hemos terminado todavía. No, no, no. no Entonces, no, no sé si o no sé, pero uh, no sé si Nidia, creo que se llama la muchacha que habla conmigo también le enviaron el mismo mensaje, entonces no sé si alguien más le han enviado ese mensaje, sería a quizás también, para... A mí también me lo mandaron. Uh -huh. A mí también. Ok. Um, man, honestly, I, I would like to you if I tell you what it is exactly, but <clears throat> we can report it. Um, lo que podemos hacer... Eh, o sea, pregunten, eh, ¿por qué? porque si no, no sé qué formulario es el que les enviaron, tal vez ahí sí pueden preguntar para qué, o sea, siéntense en libertad de preguntar para qué es, o por qué, right, or something like that, eh, porque yo les mentiría, la verdad, no, no sé, no sé cuál es el que les enviaron y por qué se los habrán enviado, pero probably eh, podría ser um, que había alguna información que faltaba, o para completar información, o probablemente ya para el siguiente, o I don't know, I've been honest, mm. I just don't know. Disculpe. Mm -hmm. Dice me. que eh, para dar continuidad a su aprendizaje. Ah. Okay. Inscribirse al siguiente módulo. O sea, yo ah, pienso es una precalificación sí es para, entonces. Ajá. O sea, yo pienso que es mandar el formulario para cuando ya terminemos el, el módulo de este que estamos ahorita, el principiante, poder pasar al siguiente. Bueno, right. me imagino, la verdad, yo tampoco he preguntado. Mm -hmm. Sí, 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 como usted me lo dijo ahorita, that's what it is. Mm -hmm. That's what it is. Mm -hmm. The way you say it right now, or probably that's exactly what they're talking about. Sí, es como para tener ya el banco de su info ahí, ya como pendentón, y al final pues ya es solo de una vez, va. ya terminamos, pasaron, entonces boom, démosle. So, Charlie, that's what it is. Uh -huh. uh, so that's pretty, mu pretty much that's what it is. Um, Any other question, guys? No? No more questions? Okay, so before we start, I'm going to start with the attendance. So I'm gonna ask you guys to say uh, I'm here or present if you are here, okay? So let's go with Aaron Omar. Okay. Ada Elisit. Eh, Ana Beatriz. No. Ana Esmeralda. Present. Thank you. Uh, Ana Noemi. Present. 
Carlos Vladimir. I'm here. Thank you so much. And let's go with uh, Consuelo del Rosario. I'm here. Elida Maritza. <clears throat> Flor de María. Present. Uh, Jasmine Magdalena. Joana Guadalupe. Present. Jonathan Alexander. I'm here. Thank you, Jose Ismael. Okay, uh, Jose Salvador. I'm here. Catherine Tatiana. Present. Uh, Kenny Guadalupe. I'm here. Uh, Marilyn Yvonne. Present. Okay, uh, Marlene Concepcion. Thank you. Marvin Omar. Nidia Jamilet. Present. Um, Nixia. Present. Omar Luzardo. I'm here. Thank you so much. Let's go with Rebecca Beatriz. I'm here. Mm -hmm. Reina Lisette. Present. Uh, Ricardo Alfonso. Rosario Cristabel. Wilber Enrique. Present. Yesenia Abigail. Selena. Uh -huh. Selena Elizabeth. Okay, cool. Thank you. Uh, thank you guys for helping me uh, with the attendance right here. And so, uh, do you have any other question, guys, or anything you want to say? ¿Alguna otra pregunta? ¿Algo que quisieran eh, preguntar? ¿Compartir? ¿Anything? Profe, yo, teacher, yo tengo una pregunta. Eh, ayer este, pidieron información de, de unas preguntas que no podían eh, contestar. Bueno, entonces yo les compartí las capturas. Eh, la persona me dijo gracias. La cosa es de que después yo puse your way, como sea, queriendo decir de nada. Uh -huh. Entonces... Eh, luego yo lo eliminé porque no, no me acuerdo exactamente si es your welcome o es you welcome. Entonces dije yo, yeah, la yeah, pena, yeah. dije yo, no sé que me equivocamos o lo elimino. Entonces quiero <risa> que me saque de, 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 de esa duda, yeah. por favor. <risa> sí, 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 no, no hay problema, no problem. Thank you for asking, thank you for asking, Wilbur. Yes, for sure, I'm, I'm going to help you with that right now. So just give me a second right here. Okay, so... Yes. All right. Okay. Can you see my screen? Yes. Well, yes. Okay. yes. All right. Yeah. So you say, you're welcome. Like this. You're welcome. So, yeah. you. Uh, that's basically what it is. I mean, we're not going to translate this le to the literal meaning. But uh, that's what you say, de nada, you're welcome. Mm -hmm. um, no queramos traducirlo, porque si lo queremos traducir, es como va a decir, tú seas bienvenido. <laughs> okay, pero no, right? It's not like that. Um, yeah, it's written the same way, but it's, it's, not, it's not like that. So, entonces, you're welcome, like that. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay, gracias, gracias. Mm -hmm. uh, or... Another form is like, um, well, it's, it's as literal, uh, así podemos usarlo. Aunque también puede decir, si alguien le dice, hey, thank you, usted puede decir, no problem, no hay problema, right? No problem. Mm -hmm. Like saying, mm -hmm. no problem. Or you can say like, no sweat. Like this, no sweat. Um, there's another thing you can say. But yeah, those are a few things that you can say, like, no problem, it's okay, don't worry. Mm -hmm. So those are things that you guys can say. Um, all right, any other question, guys? No? Yo quisiera, prof, eh, teacher, 
Es que para mí es más difícil hablar en inglés. Mire, no ¿Qué? se preocupe, tranquila. Yo sé, yo sé que nos cuesta, pero usted pregunte, yo aquí estoy, ¿ok? Ok, este, es que veo que muchos eh, escriben y dicen a todos presente, entonces yo quisiera que le que explicara lo mejor porque después también ponen en el, en el, en el WhatsApp que pues se conectaron después o no saben si se toman en cuenta o, o cómo está, porque a veces les, no sé si ya se fijó que en los mensajes le ponen presente. Sí, sí me fijo, um, les dicen eso. Porque ellos pueden ver los minutos que estuvieron conectados. Entonces, desde el momento que se conectan hasta el momento que se desconectan, ahí les va marcando. Entonces, ah, por eso es que les dicen que no se conectaron antes o que esto, lo No, otro. Cuando, cuando usted ya ha pasado la que nos ha pasado lista uh -huh. y tal vez ellos no han contestado. Uh -huh. Por ejemplo, ahorita voy llegando, dice uno presente, usted ya pasó lista. Uh -huh. No sé si, es, si eso cuenta o no cuenta, para, así que nos quede más claro a todos. Más sí. que todo a ellos que por A o X motivo no lo hacen. Pues sí cuenta, y de hecho yo por eso les, les digo siempre, les digo, ayúdenme y díganme, estoy aquí, estoy presente. <risa> ah, bueno. Ajá, entonces por eso les digo. Ajá, pero claro, o sea... Se conectaron, eh, sí, está bien. Eh, ahora lo que se sabe es que también cuando sacan el, el reporte de asistencia y ven los minutos y quiénes han estado y todo, aparte de los reportes que uno hace, de que si, si le contestan, no le contestan, tienen cámara encendida o no y todo eso. Uh -huh. Ya. Yeah. Es, okay. es, es un conjunto de cositas que toman en cuenta. Uh -huh. Ok. Ajá, yeah, thank you, thank you sí, sir, una pregunta. Y si y después nos van a mandar eso, si, si tenemos alguna falta o nosotros lo podemos solicitar. Yo creería que pueden solicitarlo, sí. Uh -huh. I will say that you can ask for that. Uh -huh. so, de hecho, por eso les decía, de cuando tengan problemas, que no se puedan unir, trabajo, esto, lo otro uno muere, pues resucita, entonces eh, hay que avisar, <risa> no, eso no, este, <risa> o sea, pues sí, hay que avisar, ¿ve? hay que avisar, mire, fíjese que, este, me pasó esto y esto, entonces, oh, no voy a poder por esto, porque la asistencia es bien importante, entonces, por, pues por eso de que, si no, ya no los toman en cuenta, ¿va? entonces, por eso, <risa> so that's what you guys have to do, siempre que tengo un problema con asistencia o algo, incluso antes de, no, no quiero que suene como raro esto, pero incluso es más importante que lo, que lo, que lo, uh, how do you say that? It's, it's better that you, uh, you say that to, um, to Andy than me, porque ellos son los que llevan el control de, de asistencia. Entonces, like, um, ellos son los que van sacando los minutos así y segundos. I'm just teaching the class, you know, I'm just teaching the class, but they are doing that. So, yeah, try to uh, say that if you have any issue or anything, you just report it. Traten de reportar siempre eso. So that's what I can tell you. Mm -hmm. okay, mm -hmm. okay, okay, okay. All right. Um, any other question? No? No, Mr. Okay, no more questions. All right. Whew. All right, guys, let's start in. <laughs> you know, we're about to finish actually the unit. Uh, no, it's it's like unit three actually, but it's in section three. So what we are going to be doing, uh, one, two, three, four. What we're going to be doing today, guys, is that we're going to try to do a little review on the topics, but we will just finish as well what we started uh, yesterday, right? We're going to be talking about uh, adjectives today as well, and which is pretty much, well, we talked about adjectives, but we're going to be doing a little practice as well, okay? And so that's what uh, we need to do, right? That's pretty much what we need to do or what we want to do this week, uh, this class. Uh, besides that, I'm going to be um, answering any questions that you have related uh, any topic or related, uh, I don't know, any of the things that you want to say about the questions regarding your uh, midterm or anything, you know. So we'll be checking on all that as well. Uh, just to remember a little bit, I'm going to play the video once again. I know we did it yesterday, but we'll do it today as well. So you guys can remember what it is and how we use it, okay? So here we go. Just so you can help us just like a little review. 
Hi everyone. In this class you'll learn adjectives which describe the personality and appearance of people. Let's get started by listening and repeating adjectives. I'll go ahead and play the audio and you should listen and repeat. He's really tall. He's short. She's a little heavy. She's thin. He's handsome. She's very pretty. They're good looking. She's really friendly. He's quiet. She's talkative. She's serious. He's funny. She's shy. Now, what I would like for you to do is to give an example for each adjective that you learn. I would like for you to talk about a friend, a family member, coworker that you know whom you can describe with an adjective or adjectives that we just learned. For example, my friend John is really tall. My cousin Mary is a little short. My coworker Chris is a little heavy. After you do this, you should share your work. Okay, we'll stop it right there. Okay, so this is pretty much what we have about the adjectives, okay? So, um, so we can describe people, you know? That's the reason why we have the adjectives, so we can describe people. For example, I can say, Omar Luzardo is tall and friendly, okay? Now, I'm describing Omar, okay? So, estoy describiendo Omar. So, I can do that, and that's what we can do. I can also describe myself. I can say, I'm, uh, I will say, I'm tall, eh, talkative, and serious. I don't know. I'm just saying, okay? So, I can say that about me. Yo puedo escribirme a mí también así, de esa forma. So, that's actually what we can do. And that's what we were talking about yesterday. So just remember, just remember how we have to do it. And it's like, for example, um, yeah, you can, I hate this. Thing. All right. All right, there we go. I hate this thing. I hate it. All right, so um, I can say something like, um, um, all right. I can say, um, which is I am, right? It's contracted. Um, short, talkative, and funny. That's just an example. Okay, um, short, talkative, and funny. Okay, and I can also say, um, then I can say, uh, my brother or my sister, my brother, is um i will say heavy shy and and what i don't know another adjective and tall for example all right so those are a few adjectives now one thing with these adjectives we can actually um describe appearance okay we can describe people's appearance and and also we can describe people's personality okay so that's what we can do personality so that's basically what we can do right here now if i say that omar is a talkative is that appearance or personality mm-hmm if I say Omar is talkative, is that appearance or personality? Personality. Personality. Yes, because it's talkative, right? It's not how it's showing. Okay, yeah, that's basically what it is, you know. And that's pretty much what we uh, have to work on with these things, okay? Now, um, okay, now one more thing. 
I'm gonna, let me just check one thing here. Let's see, give me just a minute, just a minute. Da -da -da -da. Description, okay, cool. All right, now I'm gonna, I'm going to give you right now a few minutes. Um, I'm gonna give you right now, uh, I will say like three to five minutes and write the adjectives of personality right here on this side. You can do that, uh, you can do my bad. You can do that on your on your notebook. So you're going to write personality and you write all the adjectives that are from personality in this side. And then you go in the other side and the adjectives that are regarding appearance, you write them on this side. So you can do that on your um on your notebook. I'm gonna give you five minutes. Okay. Vamos a hacer eso. Escriben los en su cuadernito los personality adjectives. Y en el otro lado, los appearance adjectives, okay? So I'm going to give you five minutes. You can raise your virtual hand whenever you finished. Puede levantar su manita virtual cuando termine. You can raise your virtual hand whenever you finished. Raise your virtual hand whenever you finish. Levanten su mano virtual cuando terminen, please. So we can check it. If you have a question, let me know. Si tienen preguntas, me dicen. Una, una pregunta, teacher. Eh, es Hanson. Hanson. Uh, it's like Wapo. <laughs> That's a handsome. Mm -hmm. Like us, you know? Like we, all the men that are here, you know? <laughs> Teacher, we must create 
uh, sentence? Not yet. Not yet. We will do it, but not yet. Lo vamos a hacer, pero no todavía. <laughs> not yet. All right. ¿Cómo van los demás? ¿Siguen trabajando? Solo veo a Omar ahí con la manita levantada. Esa es mi, eh, mi señal de que ya terminaron. Si tienen su manita virtual levantada. Okay. No, no la de verdad, no van a estar así toda la, la clase. <ríe> no, la virtual. Okay. The virtual hand. That's the one I want. Okay, I got three people that finished. Tengo tres ahí que dicen que ya terminaron. ¿Y los demás van bien? Necesitamos. Una tiempo. consulta, teacher. Ah, tell me, quiet, tell me. quiet es. Like, es apariencia o. Mm, o quieto. Porque, ajá, porque quieto es estar mm. tranquilo. Pero, I will say that it's not appearance. It's more regarding the personality because that ha that's how somebody behaves. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Thank um, you. Mm -hmm. Una pregunta. No Mm -hmm. Tell me, please. Eh, con el adjetivo, they are good looking. Ese quiere decir se ven bien, ¿verdad? Lo ponemos como. Como. A, appearance. Good looking, yeah, because it's basically like you good, you look good, you know, like you have good features, you're like kind of hands on or something like that. So. Yeah, I will I will say that it goes with the with that. Okay, with the appearance. Okay, let's check it. Let's check it. Okay, let's see. We're going to go one by one. One by one. So it says, uh, let's see right here. Tall. What is it? Appearance or personality? What do you think? Appearance. Yes. What about short? Appearance. Mm -hmm. What about heavy? Appearance. Mm -hmm. What about if we say friendly? Personality. Personality. Mm -hmm. Personality. And if I say good looking? Personality. Appearance. 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 Mm -hmm. If I say... Mm -hmm. Thing. Appearance. Appearance. Handsome. Personality. Appearance. I will. It's appearance, actually. It's appearance, like you know, like guapo, right? Appearance. Guapo. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's just for men. Solo para hombres, okay? Just for men. Um, pretty. What about pretty? Appearance. Appearance. Quiet. Bonnie. Personality. 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 Mm -hmm. Talkative. Personality. 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 Mm -hmm. Talkative. Personality. 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 Mm -hmm. Talkative. Personality. 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 Funny. Personality. 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 And serious. Personality. 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 Yes, that's what it is. Okay. Now, yes, now we are going to do the next thing. Uh, now it says, I'm funny, smart, and very handsome. Okay, this is what you're going to do. You're going to write something like this. You're going to describe yourself and one more person. You can write that on your notebook. Usted va a escribirse usted misma o mismo. Y a otra persona más. It can be your friend, your mother. Se pueden más de una persona. It's okay. Right? I'm going to give you right now um, a few minutes. And then I'm going to ask you. Okay? You can write that on your notebook. Okay? Yes? Do you understand what we're doing right now? So you're describing yourself. Uh, and one more person. It can be your friend, your mother, your brother, your sister, your son, your wife, your husband. Any person. Okay? So, 
And again, raise your virtual hand whenever you finished, okay? Y otra vez, levanten su manita virtual cuando hayan terminado. When you finish, please. Which sentence? Uh, Sorry? Which sentence? Mm, I mean, it's not a sentence. It's a description. Um, like, like the example I just have here on my screen, like you will describe yourself. For example, in my case, I'm short, talkative, and funny. And then I'm going to describe somebody else. Like in my case, I'm describing my brother. My brother is heavy, shy, and tall. So something like this, something like this right here on the screen. Mm -hmm. I don't know if that's clear now. Um, well, you let me know if you have a question. It And try to use appearance and personality adjectives. Try to use both. Oh, on a question. Um, Tell me. Is heavy, little heavy is intense or, or? Heavy, it's like, it's a polite way to say um, gordito, <laughs> right? Like play a neat. Ah, okay. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. thanks. You're welcome, you're welcome. And if I can say chubby? Yes, yes, you can say chubby, but it's not polite. No es como muy, how do you say that? Polite no es, no es como muy cortés decirle a alguien así. Ya podría ser ofensivo. Entonces usted le dice heavy, no, está gordito, ok, no le ofende o... Oh. But, pero si le dice chavi es como, mm, mm, mm. <laughs> ok, so don't say that. <laughs> A menos que sea su amigo y que le pueda decir así, ¿va? entonces ahí sí, dele. <laughs> <laughs> ¿Cuántas íbamos a hacer? Um, yourself and one more person. So, okay, finish. And one more person. Okay, cool, cool. All right. One more minute for the ones that haven't finished. Okay, guys, we will uh, start checking this right now, okay? All right, but we're going to ask the question right here. What are you like? Which is, como eres tú, right? And that's asking for a description. Or, what is your friend like? Okay, so that's what it is. 
And I'm going to uh, I'm going to start right now asking um let's see Jonathan Jonathan Gijen what are you like Jonathan uh, I'm sure um talkative short and talkative okay what is your friend like My brother. Okay. My brother is tall and serious personality. Okay. My brother is tall and serious. Mm -hmm. Serious. Okay. That's pretty good. Now you, Jonathan, ask one of these questions or both questions, if you want, to one of your classmates. Ahora se pregúntele una o las dos si quiere a, sus compañer a su compañero. Y después su compañero, a quien le pregunten, Va a ser la misma dinámica. Vamos a ir, vamos a ir, vamos a ir, vamos a ir, and so on, okay? We'll keep on going. Así que mire, yo ahorita solo escuchándolos. <laughs> okay. No, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna do some correction if needed. But let's go. Let's go, Jonathan. Uh, Joana Guadalupe, what, what are you like? Um, I like Um, no. um, ahí no necesitamos decir like, I'm like, solo um, y ya. Ah, I'm, I'm friendly. Um, sometimes talkative. Okay. Now is your turn. Um, what is your friend like? Uh, Wilbur. Um, my friend is angry. Okay. What else? Give him more adjectives. Démosle más adjetivos a su amigo. Let's give him more adjectives. Mm -hmm. And the ones we have here. Mm -hmm. No. Nope. Okay, if not, you don't want to do that, just go ahead and ask uh, the question to one of your classmates then. Go for it. Ah, a, a, a Wilbur le preguntaron, ¿cierto? Yeah, yeah, Wilbur, yeah. Sí? Yes. Okay, bye, Wilbur. Si no, no va a dar más descripción de su amigo, uh, hágame el favor, pregúntele una de estas preguntas a sus compañeros o las dos, si usted quiere. Um, que no vean. Es que siento que me cuesta un poco la. Ahora. Solo dígale. Como, como hablar. Ah, no, tranquilo, tranquilo. Por eso estamos practicando el speaking para que no nos vaya costando después. <risa> que nos vaya costando menos. Ajá. So, what is your friend like o what are you like? Mm -hmm. uh, Carlos Vladimir. Um, What is your friend like? Mm -hmm. Good job, good job. Mm -hmm. Ya ven, bien chivo le salió. <laughs> My friend is shy and thin. Okay, okay, that's a good one. All right. Now you, Carlos, ask somebody else, please. Okay. Uh, Nixia Vasquez, what are you like? I am tall. I have him. Um, serious. Serious. Mm -hmm. Serious. Mm -hmm. Okay, good job. Keep going, please. Mm -hmm. 
Now you ask somebody else, please. Mm -hmm. I don't want to tell you. Where do friends fly? It's my daughter. Okay, okay. Tell us about your daughter. Uh huh. Is our daughter is talkative, pretty, and funny, and very, very fun. Okay, good. How so, old is your daughter? Um, how old? How old is your daughter? How old? Uh, Mm -hmm. Um, my daughter and all five years. Okay, my five, daughter is five old years. Well, five years old. Five years old. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Mm -hmm. You can say my daughter is five years old, or you can say she is five years old. Mm -hmm. Five years old. Uh huh. Yeah, that's what it is. Okay. Okay. Pretty good. Ah, uh, no, you. Aquí anda saltando por ahí. <laughs> ah, ya le escuchamos. <laughs> we listen to her. <laughs> okay, Aaron. Now you ask one of those questions to one of your classmates, please. What is your friend like, Marilyn Yvonne? Oh, oh, okay, okay. My friend like... My friend no. is... Oh, uh, he is... My friend is very tall and smart. Tall, tall. Tall, tall and smart. Mm -hmm. Perdón, solo una vez tall. <laughs> tall and smart. Tall mm -hmm. and smart. Mm -hmm. Yes, good job. Thank you. Thank you, Marilyn. <laughs> now you ask okay. a question to somebody else. Mm -hmm. Ajá, este, um, Mar de Paz, what are you like? Mm -hmm. I am sure, talkative and friendly. Good job, uh -huh. all right. Now you ask a question to somebody else. Okay. Catherine. Yo creo que Catherine es la que más sabe de todo. Casi se parece al teacher para hablar inglés. <laughs> no le cuesta mucho. <laughs> eh, what are you like, Catherine? Okay. I am family, heavy, funny, and talkative. You're not heavy. Yes. A little bit, but I am heavy. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Por right, ratito de heavy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Catherine. Because I love you. <laughs> All right, now you. Your turn. Okay. And let me see. And Rebecca Beatriz, what does your film like? Sorry. And um, my cousin, um, she's tall, friendly, and very funny. And um, mm -hmm. Marilyn Yvonne, what are your lines? Uh -huh, yes, yes, yes. Yes, you said it good. Yeah, good job. Good job with that. Mm -hmm. I'm talkative and friendly. Talkative and friendly. Uh -huh. Solicitada hasta ahora, Marilyn. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay, Marilyn. Now you ask somebody else, please. Uh -huh. um, Omar Luzardo, what is your friend like? My friend is talkative. 
Okay, pretty good. Okay, stall and talkative. All right, cool. That's awesome. All right, now we'll stop it right here. We're going to do something else. I'm going to tell you something. Uh, just so you know. Vamos a tratar de trabajar ahorita en esta activity that is missing. We're going to work on this activity that is missing. Then, then we are going to, uh, después si tienen preguntas sobre algún tema en específico, las vamos a ver. Y si no, vamos a, a seguir con la segunda parte de la speaking activity, okay? La segunda, the second part of this is uh, just asking questions, you know, like talking a little bit. Da -da 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 -da. Okay, I was going to do breakout rooms, but I don't think the time will be enough, but we'll see, okay? If not, we'll do it next week as well. But this is what it is. Uh, let's try to listen, okay? Let's try to listen. It says, listen to four descriptions. Um, check the correct adjective for each description, okay? That's what we have to do. So uh, I'm going to play the audio. Let's go poner el audio. Y ustedes van a escuchar, Karen is, what, short, tall, Marco is heavy, thin, uh, Elena is, what, how is she, you know? So you're going to select one of the options. If you want, si ustedes eh, quieren, pueden escribir lo que escuchen, como es Karen, en su cuadernito. Por ejemplo, number one, Karen is, short, Karen is, tall. Okay, if you haven't done it, si de casualidad no lo han hecho, si ya lo hicieron, pues, good. Hagámoslo otra vez. <laughs> let's pay attention once again. All right, let's practice once again. So here we go. If he plays. It's not playing. You can play in the in the left. Corner. Left yeah, corner. The, the left corner? I mean, I'm, I'm here. Like you mean uh -huh. here? <laughs> right. Oh, that's a right. <laughs> okay. Don't lie to me, Catherine. Don't lie to me, please. <laughs> okay. Listen to four descriptions. Can you hear that? Yes? Yes. yes. Let's Check go. the correct words. One. What's your friend Karen like? She's a little quiet, but she's really smart. Is she very tall? No. No, she's not. She's short. Two. Who's that over there? My brother, Marco. He's only eight. Well, he's very cute. Marco? I don't think he's cute, <laughs> but he's a little thin. Three. Wow, who's that? She's really pretty. Oh, that's my girlfriend, Elena. Really? What's she like? Well, she's pretty, and she's really friendly. Four. What's Andrew like? Hmm. He's a little heavy, but he's very handsome. Is he funny? Funny? Uh, well, no. He's not funny, but he's very handsome. Okay. All right, so what about number one? How is Karen? Is she tall or short? Short. 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 Yes. Short. What about Marco? Antonio, sorry. <laughs> what about Marco? What's Marco like? Heavy or thin? Thin. Thin. Marco is thin. Marco is thin. Mm -hmm. And what about Elena? What's she like? Friendly. 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 Mm -hmm. So we say she is friendly. Yeah. What about Andrew? Serious. 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 Are you sure? Funny. <laughs> no, yeah, it's serious. Yeah, it's serious. Amazing. Is he, is he funny, listen? Funny? No, he's not funny, but he's very handsome, she says. <laughs> so he is serious, right? So now we hit next, and good job, guys. You got 10. Yay, you got 10 right there. Okay, so that's what it is. Okay, guys, now I want to ask you, 
do you have any question about any of the topics that we have studied? Tienen alguna pregunta, alguno de los temas que hemos visto? Yeah. What is thing? Thing. Delgadito. <laughs> right? Delgado. That's what it is. I am not thing. <laughs> I'm not thing either, you know? I'm not thing either, you know? I'm kind of heavy. <laughs> Okay. Uh huh. What else? Any other question, guys? I mean, any question about any of the topics or anything like that? Mm hmm. Preguntas? Confesiones? No? No. Todo está claro como el café. Confessions. Okay. <laughs> like the coffee. You know, I don't have coffee anymore here. Okay. Hoy no he tomado café. Es que yo me la tomé antes. <laughs> okay, si ¿Sí me ve, si ¿Sí me ve. All right, so, uh -huh. any other question? Any question, guys? Uh huh, no? Seguros. Vaya, if we don't have any question, we're going to continue with the speaking activity. Now, when we talk about the speaking activity, guys, there are a few questions uh, or a few things that I want to practice with you. For example, we have very basic questions like, you know, what's your name? What's your last name? Okay. What's your name or last name? Okay. You can also say, how do you spell your name? How do you spell your name? Um, or you can say last name or something. Nickname. Nickname. Yeah. Thank you. Uh-huh. The nickname, how do you spell your nickname, whatever, you know, you name it. Then we were also talking about, uh, you know, this right here. Uh, we can say like, uh, you know, things like. Seven. Okay. So uh, like you can say, what's her name, for example, what's her name or how do you spell her name? Okay. Things like that. Okay. How do you spell um, her or his name? Okay, so those are a few questions that we are going to practice right now. For example, we have been talking about these. Uh, we were talking about like the uh, questions like, are you, da -da 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 -da, okay, something like that. Um, are you, my bad, I hate this when this happens. Okay, are you, okay, or is she right so these are the just no questions with the verb to be right so you guys remember that uh, we can also have like a i will say uh wh questions which is pretty much what we did last time like we can say like what's your phone number phone number or you can say um email for example What's your email or anything, you know, anything you guys want to ask. That's another way. That's another question that we can ask. And then that's basically what we can do, right? Um, we can say, what is this? What are those? You know, things like that. Okay. So those are a few of the questions. And speak, and this is basically, you know, part of the speaking activity that I want that I want to do. Would, would you? What's this? Or what? are this right or is this is this um something you know things like that okay so you can say is this a pen for example and you can show is this a pen you know yes it is no it's not right so those are a few of the questions that we have and so this is pretty much where we were talking about Right, you can you can ask like uh the questions with the prepositions as well, you know, something like that, and you can ask something like, um, where is a cell phone, for example? That's another another question, right? And then we have some answers for that, and that's pretty much what we were talking about, you know, like where are you from, you know, where are you from, right? Um. Are you from Spain, for example? Okay, and that's the way we go. Okay, so this is this is just a, like a little review. This is como un pequeño review o pre, acerca como preguntas. 
de todo lo que hemos estado viendo durante estos um, two weeks, right? It's been two weeks already. Ya pasaron dos semanas. Wow. <laughs> no, es solo uno. No me acuerdo. Bueno. <laughs> What I'm saying is two, right? Okay. Qué rápido el tiempo, okay? So that's what it is, you know? So guys, let's focus on that. Okay, so this is what it is, guys. Um, esas son algunas questions que tenemos acá. Okay, uh, for example, what's your name? You know, how old are you? What are you like? You know, so things like that. Um, okay, how old is Maria, for example? I mean, that's another question. So I'm going to ask... Um, Catherine, ask one of these questions to one of your classmates, please. Mm -hmm. Any, just one of the questions, Catherine. Go, Catherine, go, you can do it. Yeah. And maybe Consuelo. Um, What is your phone number, Consuelo? It is, así, ¿verdad? It, ajá. It, six, cero, six, do, three, Um, eight, four, four, um, six. Okay, thank you so much. Now you go ahead, Consuelo, ask one of those questions to one of your classmates. Mm. Uh, Ana Esmeralda. Um, where are you from? I am I'm from El Salvador. El Salvador? Mm -hmm. Vamos, Anita, le toca, le toca. It's your turn to ask a question. Okay. Wilbur and Enrique. What are you like? Ah, uh, escuché como como cortada, no entendí muy bien. Ask her to repeat. Mm -hmm. Ask her to repeat. Dígale. What you are you like? Por ejemplo, Consuelo. Let's let's go with Wilbur. Let's go with Wilbur. Sorry, Consuelo. Uh, let's help Wilbur here. Okay, Wilbur. The question is, what are you like? Mm -hmm. Um, um, can um, work um, and very friendly. Okay, uh, okay, uh, you can say, yeah, I'm hardworking and friendly. Okay, that's okay. Now you ask one of these questions to one of your classmates, please. Okay. Um, Ana Beatriz. Um, No hay otra pregunta. Cualquiera de las que están aquí. Any of this. Tranquilo, Wilber, tranquilo. Cualquiera de las que están aquí. No, ¿Sí puedo ver mi pantalla? Cualquiera de sí, estas. Sí, sí, sí. La que a usted le guste más. <risa> Ajá. Um, where are you? 
What are you like? That's a good one. Mm -hmm. uh, I like or, or mm -hmm. I am. Um, mm -hmm. um serious? Mm -hmm. Tall and shy. Okay, good job. Now you wanna ask somebody else, please. What is your phone number? Phone number or oh, cell phone number. Hello? No stop? Bueno. Okay, guys. Bye. If you want, you can just kind of copy these questions here and you guys can, uh, you know, have this, I mean, like taking a screenshot or anything, you know, you can have that for you. Okay, guys, solo un recordatorio, traten de trabajar en la platform, asegúrense que tengan todo, acuérdense que está el midterm, tienen hasta tomorrow midnight to complete everything, okay? And so guys, nos veríamos, eh, we will meet next Monday, all right? So, that is where we are going to meet. So I see you guys. Bye bye. You guys take care. Solo una consulta. Ah, chame, chame, chame. Chame. Solo una consulta. El examen de el midterm que nos que nos menciona cuándo lo pasarían. Si el lunes o lo pasarían a los correos para que uno lo elabore. Ah, okay. Buena pregunta. Fíjese que está en la sección 3. Cuando usted se mete a la sección 3, cuando usted entra a la sección 3, acá aparece midterm. De hecho, después del último ejercicio que vamos que acabamos de hacer de, de listening, usted le da siguiente y de una vez lo va a llevar al midterm. Uh -huh. That's it. I don't know if that makes sense. Yes. Eh, o sea que hay que hacerlo entonces. Sí, de, de, se los he estado anunciando de, desde, desde el lunes, sí. Pueden comenzar a hacerlo. Bueno, de hecho, tienen hasta mañana para hacerlo, si no me equivoco, mañana a la medianoche. So, uh -huh. you, ha you have to do it. Mm -hmm. You guys need to work on this. Mm -hmm. Ok. Uh -huh. Ok, gracias. Sí, sí, eh, pero ahí ustedes lo hacen tranquilitos eh, con su tiempo. Mm -hmm. Ok. All right, any other question? All right, guys, sorry, I have to leave you. I have another class right there. Uh, but anything you can just ask on the group and we'll be right there, okay? We'll stay tuned. All right, guys, Um, bye-bye. I'll see you. Enjoy your weekend. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye, guys.